Looks like we're doing this. This is our microphone. We're gonna be the uh, ASMR of it. <laughs> Welcome to my ASMR. We're gonna stop it immediately. So, brother, what's up? How you been? It's been really good. I've uh, I've played Ultimate like a coward for the past like four months, so I'm kind of sh shit at melee now. But I'm getting back into swinging things, and I'm very happy. Can you hear me when I talk here? Okay. Um. Oh, hey! Go. Was right. I just muted the whole time? Yeah. Uh, I did not realize that. What? Yeah, so what? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. I think his, yeah, his was muted the whole time. Alright, we've got a spicy bird versus bark. If it's last stock, we kind of like missed the whole game. Oh! oh. That's probably it's a fine. Good. It's the, it's the healing factor we got going on here. <laughs> Oh god, I was supposed to go to Senor Taco with Charlos. You're not? Because well, now, I'm, now I'm on the mic. Nick won that, yeah. Alright, we, we got some spicy Falco. I'm very bad at like understanding neutral between these characters because I, I play Pub. Uh... Falco wants to control his space with a lot of lasers, and Mark wants to use his extended hitboxes to control Falco's already controlled space. So, if Mark can get, like, if he can kind of bait out his movement, yes, yeah, see that guy. If he can bait out his movement a lot, yeah. and get him to fire either, like, false lasers and power shield him, or he can uh, get him to whiff a punish and get his good grab. And, you know, I think that's the most of, like, what I understand about these kind of Yeah. What is your favorite sound in the game? Favorite sound? Uh, when Captain Falcon does his upbeat and then he catches the person and he's like, yes! He like releases him. Probably that. That's, a, that's definitely a, that's high a crowd favorite. Mine is the, uh, does the taunt for, for Karin. For who? For Japanese people. Oh. Because it's just... It's really annoying. What is it? So you know how give, give, give me a representation of it. I want Dude. you to imitate it. It's like... Up. <laughs> I can't even go that high. It's like... Booty booty! That's pretty good. It's, it's pretty hype, actually. I have a I have a, a famous quote for Ben that I from Ben that I think we, we should quote often. I went up to him at a monthly back in the old SAK, back in the Ballet Academy. Okay. And I asked him, what do you think about current? And he just looked at me and he said, fuck current. <laughs> <laughs> and I think that's respectable. That is respectable, for, especially for Buck himself. <laughs> So how many sets do you have with uh, the talk? I actually never got I never got to play a set. Really? Yeah. It's thought it's thought was pretty cool. I wanted like I, I got really close to playing friendlies with them sometimes, but like every time I would, like I'd have to either play bracket or like go home. Okay. It was actually oh, oh, cool. down air! That was spicy. Henry was definitely known for his fucking uh, stage decks, dude. His stage decks were insane. 
Nice. Loser's top six. She, she's got League in her brain. It's Dude. Can I get a job here? Probably, if you ask Steven. 100%. Dude. <laughs> uh, what, what would you do? Tell like, I want you to say you're handing me your resume. I'm Steven. I'm going to interview you. So why do you feel like you'd be a good part of the SAK team? Well, I love the game. Sure. Okay. Sure. Right. Um, I'm personable. I have a personality. Right? You know? Is it per is it personal personality? It's not close to the same Not really. Because I could have a I could have a non-personable personality. Okay, but the way you describe it, never mind. It doesn't go on. Go um, on. What about your t-shirts? How many t-shirts you got? I have oh. Dude, don't even get me started on what's your shoe size. <laughs> Eleven? How many hairs are on your head? <laughs> Enough. Enough hair. Okay. <laughs> How often do you get Damn. enough of those hairs cut? Uh, not very often, actually. Okay. I, I'm sure you can tell. Okay, okay. Um, I can... I know how computers work, because I'm a zoomer. Yeah. Uh, what does that mean? Like, do you drive for that, that thing, Zoom? Nah. For that I, app? So you know how you know how you have baby boomers and baby boomers? Yeah. So I'm a zoomer. I'm like a, I'm a Gen Z boomer. I'm a Gen Z, -er, but like, I was born in 2002. Oh my god. So you're four years older than my sister. Holy shit. That's weird. I'm so old. Oh my god. I'm 25 in November. I'm gonna be 17 this month. So you can't even go to war yet. You can't go to war. No, I can't. You're not allowed to go to war. I'm no. gonna say smoke. You don't look like a smoker. Maybe there's gonna be like some found form to the form of uh, justice in there. <laughs> I'm uh You're like Steve from uh the Avengers. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna freeze you in ice for the next 80 years. Please, dear god. Yeah, it's gonna happen. I hope that I hey, don't man. come out of the ice, because the fucking world is going. <laughs> what if it comes out and it's literally like six guys. It's like six people. Like all guys. You're like, how did this happen? <laughs> like, when I come out of the Yeah, you come out of the ice, <laughs> it's just like six six different guys. <laughs> One from like Nicaragua. The other one looks like lived in his mom's basement, didn't come out for like 60 years. And then he years. comes out, there's four other guys, yeah. and like, what the fuck? Yeah, you guys are all there for, as some destiny. That's your destiny. Then I, I, guess I make this are... happen tonight. It's not, a, it's not an option. You don't get to choose anymore. I can already see it. It's, it's boiling in my head. No. Oh my god, of course. <laughs> I think that the, that the... If the guys are cool, do they all speak my language? No. No, there's... Because I know you said there's a guy two of them, Nicaragua. Only two of them are English. Or two of them only speak English. One speaks very broken English. And then the other one speaks English, but he's actually from Japan, so he's got an accent. But he speaks it fluently. He speaks it fluently, though. That's cool. And then there's a guy that speaks Ebonics. Yep. It's still English. No <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> I can't. Hell yeah. Are you sure? What? Okay. I'm yes. sorry for flaking I, on you I for, think so. for Tommy. Okay. I'm not going to Senor Taco with Charlos anymore. Why? Because we're going to go to In N Out on the way home. Okay. I'm getting a fat ride home from Charlos. That was the only way I was able to come. Because my homie, right. Aiden, not to. Ghost Aiden? Yeah. Okay. I think. Ghost Aiden's a professional Fortnite player. What? He's a professional Fortnite player. Oh god. No. It's Dr. Michael. It's his birthday. Here we go. We're going on an adventure. So, the reason why I thought that it was my friend Aiden is that. So, like. Ninth grade, maybe eighth grade. Okay. I didn't memorize a piano piece for my recital, and I got grounded from going to melee tournaments. And I this was at 14. Yeah. yeah. And uh, I couldn't even go to run back for the first year I was in the community because of that. Right. It was really lame. Um. And 
So, my friend Aiden, who also plays Melee, also known as Slim Jesus. Okay. Um, he ends oh, I like Slim Jesus. Yeah, he's I a good also player. enjoy Slim Jesus' as mom. She is a very nice lady. Have you met her? Yeah, I've met her. I've, I've said hi to her when she uh, picked up her son one day. Yeah, she's nice. Yeah, she's a nice lady. I've had a... I... <laughs> I was like, hey, I play video games with your, your son that's a minor, and I'm not a minor. She's like, uh... At the, uh, at the last SPC, I, so I have the piano lessons on Tuesday, right? Right. And so, I was gonna have my dad drop me off at Aiden's house, because it's like on the way home right. from there. And then I would just go to the tournament with him. Okay. I get to his house, I knock on the door, his dad opens it, he's like, oh, hey! And he's like, surprised, but he lets me in. Right. And he's like, well, uh... Aiden's not around, <laughs> and I'm like, like I'm like, what? Why would you bring me inside? <laughs> <laughs> and like, I don't know, I just wanted to talk to you real bad, man. <laughs> it's like, you seem like a too bright kid, what do you got to offer? Yeah, uh, I mean, Aiden's dad likes me, I like Aiden's dad, he's a nice guy. Okay. Um, Did he like ask you to chill at the house for a little, or what happened? I, I don't know, and so, I, oh my god, I immediately call Aiden, right. and he doesn't answer, of course. <laughs> And then, like, 30 seconds later, he answers his phone. What if he... Okay. And I'm like... If he didn't answer, and his mom didn't... And they didn't, never came back, and we were just sitting there for hours. I'm like, Aiden, where are you? Hey, I'm hanging out with your dad. <laughs> and he's like... He's been pretty cool. He had gone to the tournament. Because even though we had been Bless messaging... You. Right. And I said I was going to go to his house, he thought I was going to the tournament he by fucking myself. Left, he fucking left you there. He's like, yeah, man, you can just... My dad can practice with you. And so Aiden's mom took me to SPC last week. Cool. Which was very nice of her. Because okay. Aiden was initially going to drive back to his house and pick me up. And he did not have to. Does Aiden drive? You don't? Uh, yeah. Okay. Now I understand the premise of the story. Get fucked, Marth. Suck dick. Damn. Yeah. I played against Rough. Joshua Washington and Bracket today. How do you and do? I got, uh, fucked. Uh, okay. Kids would say. Right. The one thing I I learned, I went up to Charlos immediately after the set. Right. And the first thing I said was, I can't fucking play neutral. Because that's the reason I lost. I kind of just got like completely fucked. So you can't play neutral, so you think you can't win a matchup? I think against Marth I can't win if I can't You're puff, right? Yeah. Okay. That's understandable. Because you can't, like... Because against, like, Spacey's, you can meme out a stop, you know? Yeah. But you can't do that as easily against Marth. Yeah. I've got the giant hitboxes, so I understand. Yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> can't believe you've done this. That was... Nice. Funky. Nick's so fucking good sometimes. I, uh... It's okay though, I'll remember how to play neutral soon. Eventually you will, yeah. I believe in you. And who else will believe in you? Henry. Henry will definitely believe in you. Dude, that, that fucked up. That fucked up. It went too soon, man. Like, I watched a video the other day of uh, him playing PUBG with a couple of friends of mine. And he said some, uh, he said some stuff that I'm not gonna say on the stream, but dude, just like hearing his voice and like hearing his laugh again, it's, it's, it's like so refreshing, you know. Even like going back on it and looking at it, it's like he's a good kid. He always has been. He's got a great, great heart. Nice, there you go. Great heart. He loved this fucking game so much. He would literally grind all the time. Just sit there and like play a whole punch for like fucking three hours before even like starting a match. Yeah, I uh, even though I like never got to like really play the game with him, like I would talk to him like at tournaments and stuff, and he was like super nice every time, and like I'd have great conversation with him. Like he was he was funny and like he got a great sense of humor. He was just like a great guy to talk to. Oh shit! There you go. Alright, now Nick just has to do that uh, yeah, two more yeah. times. If Nick wins this match, I will eat my own shirt. Alright, there you go. Eat it. Eat the shirt. That wasn't Nick. What? Not your shirt. He said that.
If Nick wins, he'll eat your shirt. No, that's not what I said. Yeah, right off your body. No, I'm not allowed. No, I can't. I'm not allowed to say that. Why? Because she's a girl. Okay, say it to me then. I mean, you can That'd say. That'd be okay. No, you we're could, just.